the heartbreaking reality behind Choji's empty chest. So I've been watching this new anime called Windbreaker. It's essentially a delinquent anime similar to something like Tokyo Revengers. And it's really good. It's animated absolutely beautifully, has good characters. Not much to the story, but it's a lot of fun. Great fight sequences, great fights. Uh, really cool anime, a lot of fun. But the last couple of episodes, I would say episode, the last three episodes have been really touching and starting to get into the emotional or the heart of Windbreaker. And I would say the very last episode really moved me. And it's all about Choji's empty treasure chest. And so at the beginning, they're showing this guy Choji, who just seems like your typical um, Hisoka, Kenpachi type character, someone who just loves to fight and loves to fight strong people. But then you start to realize that there's something else. There's something missing. There's something that he's searching for. And then he talks about in his backstory, the person who's the strongest that's the person who's the most free. And I like that concept. I like that de explanation or I like that definition. But then we see this treasure chest that he's searching for, that he's searching for. And he finally gets there. And when he looks inside, it's empty. The reason why his treasure chest is empty is because what is the reason for being strong? What is the reason for being a leader? What is the reason to stand at the front? See, he thought that it just simply was about being strong and that in itself would bring him happiness, would bring him peace. And many people have this same mistaken philosophy or ideology that if you get the job, if you get the partner, if you get the money, if you get that thing, you'll be happy. But the reality is, is that's not going to make you happy because it's the people, it's the things that you do along the way. It's never about the destination. It's all about the journey getting there. Because life is not about just one destination, it's multiple destinations, meaning multiple journeys. And hopefully, along the way, you'll make, you'll make friends and you'll meet people and you'll see things. And Choji had lost sight of that. He has lost sight of what brought him joy. It wasn't just because he was strong. It was he was strong and he was able to fight and protect his friends. And so when he got to the top and he became the leader and he became the guy that he thought he wanted to be, he realized it was empty and he felt empty, which made him angry. And so that's the sad truth. Many people live their life searching for that treasure chest and they get it and they realize that there's nothing in it. And once they realize that there's nothing more devastating Nothing crueler than that actual realization because you can't go back and make that time up. You can't spend that time with that friend. You can't treat the people right that you mistreated. You cannot replace time that's gone. So before you get to the top of the hill or the destination that you're searching for, or that thing that you want so bad, remember Choji's empty treasure chest because that's not what's going to make you happy. That's not what's going to fulfill you. It's the people and the things around you. That's what life's about.